But if you're in New York, hearing about HBCUs is not like many colleges, college, may, may high schools might not talk about HBCUs. No, they don't. Yeah. There, are, there are no HBCUs in New York City. There are no HBCUs in New York State. Wow. Mm -hmm. Right. So you have to. So then to to learn about an HBCU when you're in a state where there's no HBCU in within, I don't know, 400 miles. Right. Like, think about just all the things that have to go into that. And I don't know if that's true. There's Lincoln in Pennsylvania. I'm not sure if that's oh, okay, Cheney, I'm say you're Cheney. <laughs> right. There's Cheney. Yeah, so I'm not sure about the mileage, actually. Right. Okay. <laughs> that's, that's good. There is a radius in which there is no HBCU. Right. And that means the student has to be willing to go beyond that radius. The counselor has to have knowledge beyond that radius. There's a lot of things that have to play into that. Very true. Very, very true. Right. And we also don't even do radiuses. We tend to do state borders. So mm -hmm. there's all of that playing in, right? New York State Department of Education isn't set up to go, hey, let me teach you about Pennsylvania. They're going to teach you about New York State colleges. Right. 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 So there has to be some supplement from outside forces to broaden our viewpoint because that's not what the system was designed for. Mm -hmm.